Hello, this is uh, Dr. Naushad uh, uh, giving information on COVID-19 which is a pandemic right now. COVID stands for coronavirus disease discovered in 2019 in Wuhan city, China. So it has uh, affected uh, health and economy of all the countries worldwide and many people are suffering due to this disease. And uh, like many are suffering due to lack of information, uh, proper source of information. Today, uh, like I will elaborate the uh, uh, different aspects of coronavirus. There are cor many coronaviruses which are uh, causing several illness in animals and humans. Out of them, three are very serious conditions. Middle East Respiratory Syndrome, Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome, coronavirus disease coronavirus disease is recently discovered in december 2019 and uh, like uh, is creating lot of uh, pandemic across the world so, uh, many affected cases are there and uh, there are several deaths especially in people who are uh, more than 70 years the symptoms are fever tiredness dry cough Congestion of nose, sore throat, diarrhea. Some people will experience difficulty in breathing. It is mainly risky for a uh, old person with diabetes, hypertension or heart disease. It can create a severe complications which may require frequent hospitalization. <coughs> and uh, uh, normally uh, they will be uh, treated for a period of 2 to 3 weeks under strict isolation uh, this disease can spread from person to person mainly the virus droplets through patient's mouth or nose can land on object or any other person so touching the affected objects shaking hand rubbing the eyes nose and mouth can spread the disease hence uh, it is advised to uh, like uh, maintain one meter distance from the affected person and to prevent uh, touching uh, different objects or uh, coming in contacts with eyes nose and mouth so it is advised that we have to wash hands frequently with soap or alcohol based hand sanitizers and uh, one meter distance is recommended uh, to be maintained with the affected person we should not touch eyes, nose and mouth frequently and whenever there is a cough or sneeze we should cover our mouth with uh, mouth and nose with uh, handkerchief or tissue paper. If we have any kind of these symptoms we have to stay away from the people. It is better to stay at home, avoid traveling to places. So affected person should be isolated from the rest of the family members and uh, if any of these symptoms are there medical advice should be seeked and uh, we are providing all the emergency medical care numbers at the end of the presentation so that people can have quick access to the information and uh, uh, self medication is not recommended in these conditions because uh, it may uh, complicate the disease so it is better to take advice from the doctor only there are no approved drugs or medications for these conditions antibiotics will not work for it because it is a virus induced disease there are no fda approved medications to cure the disease no vaccines are available there are no documented proofs that particular antiviral medications can be used in this condition so the treatment is mostly symptomatic treatment and followed by isolation so which will help in recovering the condition complications will be much more in a older age if they have diabetes hypertension and other complications here we are providing uh, South India, North India related helpline numbers so that you can uh, quickly access these uh, uh, helplines to seek medical help in an emergency condition. 
and also uh, like please stay away from all the uh, public places try to isolate yourself and uh, prevention is better than cure so you should focus on maintaining the hygiene uh, and uh, try to hand your uh, like uh, wash your hands very frequently thank you very much